Do you want to have same automation in web as in your Excel or SAP? In today's video I'm going to show you how to create web automation using good old buddy Internet Explorer. Internet Explorer was on the top of the browsers almost 20 years ago. Currently, it is not supported since 2015. Now you probably ask, why can't we use any other browser than Internet Explorer? Good question, but the answer is simple. Internet Explorer is a Microsoft company product, so every Windows user has got it on its PC, at least for now. Additionally, you can already find the library in the VBE references, so there will be no problem to begin the work with that. If you want to start with the early binding, you'll need two references. Set in the options Microsoft Internet Controls for the Internet Explorer object and Microsoft HTML Object Library for the HTML document object. Of course you can go with the late binding, Setting everything as object variable is good, but it is easier to begin with early binding. The main two variables in our code are Internet Explorer object for the application and HTML document for the website. The third one, which is also needed at least, is a string for URL. As the example website, I took the simple Excel VBA. So having set the application and the URL, we can set the visibility of the application to see what is happening and go to specified URL in the IE object. To wait until the page loads, we can use here the most common method in the internet. Thanks to that, the code will not go further until everything is loaded on site. One last thing before scraping the website is to set the site HTML document to the variable. For the purpose of this video, we will do the basic thing. Use the site's browser. To start scraping, first of all, right click on the specified website and choose inspect. After that, you will see additional window something like VB immediate and watch window mixed together. This console window is showing us the code, which is responsible for how website is shown. Now choose the select element to inspect icon in the upper left corner of the console. Then click on the simple Excel VBA browser on the main page. Thanks to that, the console will highlight the code line which stands for showing the browser. In this case, the best to use will be the name of this element, S. To do the actual automate search, we need to click the magnifier icon next to the browser. Inspect this element, same as I did that in the browser case, and the console will highlight the line. In this situation, we will use class as identifier. If the value property, click method or anything is not working, try with the trick of item zero, like I did here. Getting all together, we achieved a simple example of how to do automated search on our simple Excel VBA site. I hope that from now on, using this example, you will be able to start web automation using Internet Explorer. Just like that. If you liked this video, please leave a like below. And if you want to be updated about my latest uploads, please hit that subscribe button. I really appreciate that. Also, I invite you to my website, simplexlvba.com to my Pinterest profile with all the memes from my articles, to my Facebook profile, and if you want to show your support to my channel, you can buy me a coffee. 
All the links are in the description down below. I appreciate all of your support. Thanks for watching, thanks for listening, and see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.